Initial reactions and observations by Ern Munich were dire. I don't know what Nagelsmann thinks he has going on with this system of his, but it's not working. Playing all three wingers is a disaster and the back three offers nothing. Individual brilliance bailed out the coach today and that's simply unacceptable. Robert Lewandowski is the best striker in Europe but he basically did not have a sniff at goal today. Usually it would take a prime Atletico Madrid defence to do that, but Nagelsmann has accomplished it with his winger-emphasised system. De-emphasising Lewandowski is the worst thing to have ever happened to this team's offence, which looked toothless all game. Lucas Hernandez did well winning loads of 1v1 duels with Ada Emi throughout the game. Good work by him. Niklas Sul looks like his head's already in BVB while Pavard saved Bayern from some serious blushes. This defence is so bad. The midfield is arguably just as bad too. So much to talk about post-game. Stay tuned for our podcast and analysis articles. Full time. Salzburg 1-1 by own. 88 feet, goal. Komen gets the breakthrough. 1-1. 69 feet, we're almost 70 minutes in and there are barely any life signs from by own. This is horrendous. 45 feet, well the second half is underway. Half time, Salzburg lead by own Munich 1-0 at HT. 20 feet, goal. Salzburg go 1-0 up with only 20 minutes on the clock. Defensive disaster by Bayern. Kickoff, we're underway in Salzburg. One hour until kickoff, we have lineups. So Bayern Munich are lined up in a back three, with Deotta Kano dropped and Serge Gnabry, Kingsley Komen, and Leroy Sane all starting. With Thomas Muller and Robert Lewandowski, that makes this another lineup with five forwards. At least we have a proper pivot this time. Hope the defenders are up for it. After a bitter loss to Bochum on Saturday, Bayern Munich make the short trip to Salzburg to take on Matthias Gessel and the reigning champions of the other Bundesliga. The Champions League is a curious competition, despite being international opponents, RB Salzburg have so many connections to the club they're about to face. Both Deota Kano and Marcel Sabitza are former players of the Austrian champs, while Kera Maidemi is a former Bayern Youth Academy player. Munich itself is closer to Salzburg than any Bundesliga home city, and these two teams have clashed as recently as last year, where Bayern won both games in the group stage. So what about this time? Bayern come into the game missing some key players, Manuel Ney, Alfonso Davis, Leon Goretzka, and Jamal Musiala are all out for one reason or another. In terms of suspensions, Lucas Hernandez is at risk of missing the second leg if he gets a yellow card. Salzburg, meanwhile, might miss their main striker in Benjamin Sesko, while talisman Kera made Emmys one yellow away from a suspension. Despite the absentees, Nagelsmann still has a team chock full of world-class stars who can win games on their day. When one side has the likes of Robert Lewandowski, Thomas Muller, Leroy Sane, Joshua Kimmich and the like, it's hard to bet against them. But Bochum showed by Owen's frailty last Saturday, and Salzburg will be looking to that as an inspiration. It's by own time. While you're waiting for the game, why not check out our preview podcast? Listen to it below or at this link. Match info location, Red Bull Arena, Salzburg. Austria time, 9.00 p.m. local time, 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time tips for commenting. If you're a new member, feel free to introduce yourself. We're mostly very friendly. Also, we're from all parts of the world so don't feel shy if you're from a country that doesn't seem represented on the blog. If the comment section starts to slow down for you, just hit the refresh button and keep commenting. It's not necessary to have the whole comments loaded at one time while you're just casually following along. Keep the sorting to newest to easily follow the conversation. It puts the newest comments at the top. Here at BFW we celebrate every goal like they do in the stadium, with a chant. The goal chants are for everyone to participate in. Even if you're lagging behind the others, keep replying to the most recent call of the player's name. 
even if you missed the first call, just start from the second, and so on. While swearing is allowed within reason, please be polite to your fellow posters and avoid gratuitous obscenities. Racist, homophobic, and misogynistic language is not allowed whatsoever. Check out our beginner's thread if you have any more questions. That's about it. Alf Jets. Looking for an unending well of Bio Munich content? Sign up for an SB Nation account and join the conversation on Bavarian Football Works. Whether it's full match coverage and analysis, breaking news, podcasts or something completely different, we have it all.